Hey guys, welcome back to RimWorld Naked Edition. Uh, I just started. I just had to go for like a few seconds, and something happened, so I had to, I had to get going here. I just wanted to change the zoom, and it'll do this really quick. Okay. So uh, I, was, I guess she was my guy. Savannah was feeding a Bruno, and uh, he went berserk. So and a berserk at a weird time. So he might. Uh, he might escape or even kill my person. Let's see what damage he didn't do any good. She's not bleeding yet, so she's fleeing right now. So let's see what will happen next. Ouch! What happened? Okay, she's okay. Now I just wonder if he's gonna be stuck in there. He'll probably break. Try to break down the door. Yeah. Uh, do I have? A bow. It's been a while since I played. There's a bow. Okay, we'll just go equip that. Man, a Bruno, can you not? This is a mental break, so if, if they're really unhappy, they'll go through these breaks sometimes. So he was pissed off at his little tiny cell being mistreated, so. He's still in restraint, so he'll be slow. It'll be an easy shot. There you go. <laughs> but now I have to rebuild the um, door first. Just make sure she's good on her needs. Is he bleeding or anything? Yeah, he's bleeding, but he's in no danger right now. So I've been playing, uh, I tried a different couple of different files of doing the same mode to kind of get an idea of what's, what possibilities are to come and what techniques I can kind of use. And I got really far in one of them. I have like four settlers and I'm in a pretty good spot. So I feel pretty confident about continuing that I'll be successful this time. Um, and it helps helps me make the decision whether to keep this guy or not uh, there are more opportunities sometimes easier opportunities to get more colonists but if uh, one thing I encountered was a, a slave trader that came by and I had a guy who wasn't fully uh, converted yet uh, and I was able to sell him off for like a thousand dollars so if that opportunity comes or I'll still try to convert him because my other person in my other game was also had a really low social stat. But the thing is, by trying to to hire, trying to convert, I keep saying convert. What is it called? Recruit. By trying to recruit them, they actually get better social stat, which helps with trading and stuff. So I could even just keep doing this just to kind of build my stat up a little bit. So I think it's worth it for those reasons. Um, man, playing my other game and going back to this one, this one seems so archaic. Like, I feel like I'm in such a bad spot, I guess. Let me get another familiarity with her stat. So she's psychically sensitive and trigger happy. She shoots faster but less accurate. One meal, so I need to get some food right now. She's gonna hunt. That's good. Does she have gardening? She's plants four. I should have a garden already. So we'll zone out some place to grow some stuff. Let me make sure to find a good fertilization. You see in the bottom left. I don't know if it's you can see it that well. It seems like a good area. I probably will expand out this way, so I probably want to give room. Is this more fertile? Oh, this is hyper fertile. Holy shit. I didn't know that. I thought that was possible. Let's go over here. Just do a pretty small spot. That should be enough for one or two people. So different plants you could do. Um, so not all these are food. As far as food, you got corn, potatoes, or rice. You can also do strawberries. Um, 
corn gives you more food but takes longer. Potatoes are good for growing in bad conditions, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And then rice grows fast. So I'm going to go with rice. Is this the nice fertile area? Yeah. So we'll grow some rice there in a hyper fertile soil. While she's trying to kill this buck. Now maybe I'll just let him that buck die while I gather some some bushes. Why don't you cut a bush now? Oh, she fucked it up. I feel like they yield 10. I guess maybe they're fully grown, they yield 10. I'm gonna try to cut about as many as I can carry, pretty much. Which I think is 40. Maybe it'll be, maybe it's 75 that they can carry. Just cut it all. It's pretty nice to have berries. Berries you can just eat straight up. But I think you get better value if you cook it. Yeah, you can carry a lot. She's hauling 56. So I still have Cook Simple Meal on forever. She's going to keep trying to recruit a Bruno. I should probably make him a better cell so he recruits faster and he doesn't go berserk all the time. His resistance is so high. I don't know if I've even seen somebody with this high of resistance. So basically, if you br you have to bring resistance down to zero in order to try to recruit them. And right now, the first time she tried, it was like 0.1 that she reduced. But that time, it was like 0.4 she reduced. And you can only do it every so often. But like I said, either way, if a trader comes by, or I mean a slave trader, I could sell him off. And then I'm going to get a lot of social practice. I think her social was already... No, that's his social. I think it's already gone up one level. I found out that traps are really good to survive if you're alone. He was able to survive against wild animals and, and raids. But I did find out that was a lot of raids. Other ways you can get people are... Um, sometimes a transport pod crashes. Uh, and there's like a colonist in it. Or uh, sometimes you, had, you can go rescue somebody. Or sometimes a wild person is out, and you can train them like an animal. <laughs> so there's other ways to get people. And the game seems to be aware of what, what you're going through and does stuff in accordance. It likes to throw random crappy things, and then kind of, if you need people, it'll throw some people your way and stuff. It's like a... A dungeon master in, in an RPG game. It kind of wants to be challenging, but doesn't want to like kill you off necessarily. And I found out too, when if you actually your last person dies, they actually don't. You can still reload, which I didn't think in this mode you could do. I think the mode just is is all about not being able to uh, kind of when something happens, being able to go back and trying to change it. Oh, the bucket's unconscious. Good. See, I knew he would. We shot him enough that he was going to eventually die. We're going to get this donkey. This is her cooking skill. It's only three, so. I think it needs to be five or six in order to cook better meals. And it's nice to build b better meals because you get more nutrition out of them. And your mood goes up higher. I, I would need to build a... Uh, A, a better stove instead of just the fire. Just going for a walk. When are you gonna freaking grow this stuff? Um, 
crafting's really good. That's good. And I need to build a... She's, she's naked right now. I can make a t-shirt from this? Oh, I have a tailor bench. Do I not even have... Oh, some pants. <laughs> yeah, I need a certain amount of material. That's why I should keep killing deer. So I can get that material. It needs to be the same type of material. Yeah, it's better to cook the meat, in, the meat into a meal rather than keep the meat because it'll last longer. At some point when I have like electricity and stuff, I'll need to build a fridge so my food will last longer. Uh, a great way to <clears throat> power electricity that I've found is to train boomalopes, which are kind of like boom rats, but uh, they're bigger. If you have them, you can, their milk is, uh, yeah, there we go, boomalopes. They produce chem fuel, which you can use to make electricity. And usually one is enough to f for one generator, which is like a thousand watts of electricity. Which can power a few, quite a few things. So. At some point, I want to train one of them. What is my training skill at? Oh, it's super low. Let's see how much you have to, have to train them. Oh, five? Holy crap. I'm going to have to get better handling skill or have somebody have another person who can handle better. I should probably train a, a really weak animal, or one that I can actually tame, so then I can get practice. Ooh, the fox. There's a fox that's dying. Death in 18 hours. Foxes are cute. I like to t train it if I can. I also just like birds in general, so I like having turkeys. Let's produce eggs. The foxes are just cute, so I'm gonna train it. But he's gonna die in 18 hours. Okay, before you cook that, can you try to train this guy? Animal sleeping, of course. Okay, I'm gonna leave some meat so I can train the fox. We'll suspend that right now. More butchering. Yeah, I guess I should. Well, <clears throat> let's see. The deer will last in two days. So let's first sow. Sow that ground. So just so I can make that accomplish, I'm going to increase the priority for that. Never planted on something with high fertility like that, 140%. Yeah, she sleeps deep. Oh no, I hope this fox stays alive. Oh, he, he healed himself enough that he won't die. That's good. Travelers are traveling by. I think if you live on a road, you get people more often coming by. That's what it seems like. Because I've always been on a road lately. Mostly just because it's faster to get to other places to trade. But it seems like it's another advantage with more traders coming by. Let's see where I am on the world again. This is kind of a. Is this a warm area? I, must have, I think I looked at the temperatures. Yeah, pretty moderate. Yeah, so these, are these guys friendly already? Yeah, so I could trade with all these guys. This is a great spot. This is insanely good. I'll have three different options to trade eventually. This, that's kind of in the future, though. It's like when you start running out of certain things and you need to kind of trade them. And when you have... When you produce something enough that you can kind of sell it off, too. We don't need food for a hot minute, so let's not refuel that for now. Should we 
reduce resistance by 0.3. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so she's gotten like 500 more experience, which is about a sixth of the way to the next level, which is cool. So now she's gonna get that dough or buck. It's fully sewn? Okay. Wow, the, the rice is already 28% grown, and you can harvest something at 65%. That's dope. I should have rice very promptly. Can you gather? I hate that they do that. They don't... When they gather, like, berries from far away, they don't bring it over. Most of the time, I let my, my, my uh, guys do what they need to do and don't micromanage as much, but when you just have one person... Your time is so valuable for what they do, so you have to kind of just hover over them and hyper micromanage. You know, she's a shirt. Oh, wait, no, not yet. Two work left, you didn't finish it? Went down by 0.3. Nice, t shirt. You're gonna wear it? Wear it. There we go. Now she won't be pissed off from being naked. Let's see. Um, I was gonna look at something else. I forgot. Can you tame that fox now? Where'd it go? There. Oh, you need seven for a fox. Okay. Well, let's see what's nearby me. I just want to tame something so I can start training her animal handling skill do a boom rat an animal that can like protect me would be kind of cool too but those animals require more handling skill I only see boom rats around here what is this this guy would probably be pretty tough let's see no I don't have enough Need five for an ibex. Could probably do the boomerang. There's a lot of dead animals here. Where do they die from? My other file, I had like a couple bears, and they were awesome. And bears can also haul. You can train some of your animals. Certain animals can haul things, so they'll like move stuff around, which is super useful. Maybe I'll just take a boomerang. I mean, that's kind of a liability. Because they blow up. Something's better than nothing. It needs seven for a boom rat. Jesus, can I not even tame anything? Let's see. What about... Tortoise. You need seven for a tortoise. Turkey? You need four for a turkey. Can I not train a single thing? Donkey? I could do a donkey. Okay. Where's the donkey? Donkey. Donkeys are actually sort of tough, too, so he can kind of... I could train it to protect me. What about this guy? Yeah, wargs are tough, too. She's clean now. That's how bored she is. Let's see. Probably should cook a few more things. So I'll turn that back on. Do I have stone cutting technology? I think I do start off with it. Yes, okay. So I could use that to make a better floor for myself. So we'll build a, a stone cutting table. Need some steel for that, so I might need to harvest more steel. So there's some steel. Do that. Yeah, when their environment's a little bit prettier, they'll feel better. They'll be in a better mood. Well, she seems, seems to have a pretty good mood. You can 
polish these stone walls and uh, they really like it. It gives them a bonus beauty. So I'll probably curve this out down to over here. She's smoking a joy. Did I put cook down? Oh, I suspended. That's not happening. Shit, don't give me rotted. Oh god, <laughs> went down by point one. Like I said, her social keeps going up. Uh, it's not very far. I wonder if it goes up higher if they resist the resistance goes down even more. I should build a shelf for um, for these knives. I want to keep these knives here for when somebody comes and attacks me. I can switch to a knife. But I can use the shelf as a also as a, like a barricade. We'll haul these stones so I can use them with my stone cutting table. Do I have a. I need a, I need a zone for them, though. A stockpile zone. Dumping. Make. Clear all. Just do chunks. We'll have a different. Do I have a zone for bodies yet? I must have dumped somebody somewhere. Was this the only guy who attacked me? Okay, we need a somewhere kind of far away that we can dump corpses. Clear all corpses. Human corpses. They don't like seeing corpses. Makes them makes them upset. Here's my stone cutting bench. Stone cutting lets you take a chunk like these, these little chunks, and turn them into the raw material that you can use to make different stuff. But we'll also use this to hold steel. start cutting stone blocks she's a high crafting skill so it'll probably go by really quick and we can use these stone blocks to start flooring this place make it look a little bit nicer all right I got a chunk of sandstone I got 20 right now let's see it's 20 right there a Bruno has gone berserk again Jesus. Stop breaking that door. I'll help you. Oops, nope. I don't want to shoot that. Shoot this. Okay, now shoot him. <laughs> you could knock back on that one. To keep shooting him and keep healing him. Am I bleeding? There's blood over here. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> now I have to rebuild the door first. I need wood. <laughs> oh no. So first, I need to chop some wood. Why is she so slow? Okay, I guess she's not going slow. Okay. 
Okay. Build a door. There you go. She'll save him. Um, you need to tend to him. Okay, she's going to. With the nice medicine. After I just shoot you and then use my medicine on you. Great. Oh, great. Psychic drone is just... Decreases your mood. Supposedly it's these... Space... Machines? The evil... They're evil. Sometimes they'll even crash. That stinks, so now her mood will be down. By 17, which stinks. Oh, something died. What was that? It'd be good to know, because then I can take it. it sounded like a rat. Rice is growing, it's harvestable. But the more you let it grow, the more you'll get out of it. So I might as well let it go to 100%. I have five meals left for now. If I get really low, I might harvest it. I just want to try to find the thing that died. It's a pretty cool thing. Can I? I can only deconstruct it. I want that to be my home area. Anymore. Oh wow, this is. Oh, this must be a um, one of those scary places, I guess. So there'll be like machines in there and probably some people. But I had to be decently powerful enough to fight them. It's like an ancient, ancient um, something. It's called. Ancient something is exactly what it's called. Damn. It takes so long to hurt him. Unless my meat's rotted. A little more sandstone, 20 more. Eight. Twelve. I guess I should make his place a little bit better so he doesn't keep freaking out. Well, I want to be happy first before this guy's happy. I have some limestone. Is this also limestone? Okay, I should have some 40 limestone now. like a lamp. Just they don't like to be in the dark either. Intense pain, hideous environment, he's naked. Cramped interior. <laughs> Everything's so bad for him. Whatever. That's low priority. We'll get to it eventually. Wait, does he care that he was in darkness? Whatever, we'll make we'll make some clothes for him. When we have enough. Need a lot more leather though. Oh, my food's getting low. Yeah, maybe we should harvest some of this. Or just harvest these berries. Gonna be stoned. If they're stoned, their consciousness goes down a little bit, and their which affects their moving and other things. But they get happy. <laughs> Thirteen plus mood, and it satisfies some of the recreation. And right now, there's not much to recreate with. Probably should grow some weed, actually. Do a five by five for that. 
some smoke leaf. <laughs> Really need uh food. Put growing back up to three. Do I have to cook four simple meals? No. I'm do four at a time slightly more efficient. Probably have to hunt another deer. Down to two bucks and two does. I don't think they get pregnant in the wild. I think they just automatically generate. Thank God they don't fight back. Still in a negative because the dirt, dirt will make a negative. Certain things like the marble here, or just anything that's not stored away properly, you can make a roof to store some stuff. I guess we store everything there. It has a roof. Still need food. Uh, it's 96%. Should getting it to be a better shot. So do with Shirley. She gave up on it. Is he injured? Yeah, but he might heal himself from resting. I'm like trying to shoot a sleeping deer. It's tough. Why don't you get freaking closer? And haul it, please. Oh shit, no spot to put it in. And the corpse. Only fresh. There's the donkey. Oh, there's a rat right here. Can't even tame a rat. <laughs> I guess some animals are easier to tame than others. She's probably a bad cooking stat. It's taking her a while. Three. Feed a Bruno. Try to convert him. And if he's in a better condition, he'll his resistance will go down faster too. So I'm building a roof here so I can store stuff there. When it's roofed, it won't deteriorate. I mean, food will always, when it's not cold enough, it'll deteriorate. Or spoils, I guess. There we go, now we can harvest the rice.
slowly, but surely there's resistance going down. She lifted it on the fire. She got sleepy. You only can do so much in each day. Oh, she's trying to tame the donkey now. Tame it. Tame it. Fail. Only 17% chance. Oh my god. How much rice did you use? Okay. Let's use it some more. She's gonna use up all those joints. Cooking stone. It's a good time. Uh oh, need more fuel. We'll need some more trees eventually here too. How many meals is that four meals? That was a weird number of protein or nutrients. Social set still at two. Needs a thousand more experience to go up. Cooking is gonna go up pretty soon. Oh, she botched like all the. Damn. Is this steel? Ooh. She deconstruct all this. She maybe take this table. That's ah, more valuable as. Steel? Oh, slate. Man, all you do is sleep with Savannah. Oh! Here we go, another rain. Looks like they'll prepare for a while before attacking. So I'll let her finish sleeping until they are ready to go. Oh, he's getting pretty close. She needs to eat. His name is Huntsman. Okay, let her cook while <laughs> he's preparing to attack. It'll warn me once he starts ready to attack. She's deconstructing the table, it's kind of far. Can you not do that right now? Thanks. Okay, she's cutting trees. Ooh. Fucking hell. He's berserk again. Did I get hit? got time for this, Abrunio. Man, he's gone berserk so many times. Oh, now the other people are beginning their assault. Great. Great fucking time. I'll let him escape if he escapes. I just need to deal with this first. This is more important. Hopefully this guy will run into one of the traps. No, attack this guy. Oh my god, getting flanked. Not ideal. Okay, got hit. 
I'm not gonna run into the tramp. Ah, oh, fuck. This is bad. This could be game over. Bruno. He hit the trap. But he's okay. I hope he just dies right now. Dumbass. Berserk Rage is coming to an end. He's downed. I'm gonna let him die. I don't fucking care anymore. Execute. Pissed me off too much, Abruno. Sometimes you can release them as a prisoner and you'll get um, respect from that, the, wherever they're from. Oh, he already, get, he already died. Great. Don't have to deal with him. That was a crazy squirrel. Where is it? Shit. See. Okay, go to your trap zone. You gotta deal with raids and prisoners escaping and mad squirrels. Bring it on, squirrel. Hit the trap, hit the trap! Yes! Free food for me! Where are you bringing it? Oh, the butcher. Food poisoning, ugh. Food poisoning sucks. They're really slow, then they'll puke up their food so you need to cook even more food. I'm actually out of food. I don't have any more rice. I guess there wasn't enough rice. She's not. She hasn't replanted it. Shit. Kind of a food emergency. Okay, no time to tame the donkey. Do you even have food to... Okay, before refueling, hunt the deer. <laughs> She'll walk super slow from the food poisoning. She's still also pretty hurt from the fight. She's very little consciousness. Oh, she had a simple meal on her. Oh my gosh. She's close to breaking. Sorry, you really have to make food. 
wanted to go for a walk. Her shooting is so bad right now because it's the consciousness is so low. <laughs> oh my gosh. not going to be able to hit this deer. Her sight's okay. But manipulation, which is part of shooting. Probably just melee attack, but she'll, it'll probably melee attack me back. Okay, just eat the berries. berries gosh it might even be worth eating human flesh at this point this is where the this mode can get really bad as if because usually your other colonists can kind of help each other when they're in tough spots but if you're in a tough spot and you got nobody else to help you it's pretty bad Okay, hopefully she's refueling. Yeah, refueling. You can make a meal with the, uh... She smokes the weed, she might even pass out. Because her consciousness is already so low. It's probably good for her to rest right now. Damn, things are pretty tough right now. Doesn't seem to be that hot, so I don't have to. Oh, it is getting hot. Don't need that tribal wear now that Abrunio is dead. feeling better. Oh, her food poisoning went away. Yes. Okay, girl, you really need to harvest these bushes. So we'll put plant cut to higher priority. Oh, man. Botched. All the berries. Gotta kill this rat. Although rats like take so long to hunt because they're so small, and then you get like barely any food for them. Oh sweet, four meals. That'll hold us over for a minute. Thank God that food poisoning went away. That was killing us. Four meals. Oh, there's a dough right here. Well, this one's already dying. Hell yeah, how did it die? Oh, because we were shooting it. Did we actually hit it? Yeah, we hit it, I guess. Dope sauce. I'm trying to hit a rat from so far away. another person would be so useful right now. Oh, hair. Kill that, too. Cooking food, cooking food. More food, more food. We should catch up on food here, and then we can start re the 
little garden. I'll actually probably make this into rice too for now. We'll expand this out. Because apparently one wasn't enough. Having smoke relief zone is pretty nice to have too. You can also sell smoke leaf joints really for a good price. Good value. It weighs very little and they buy it for like twelve dollars a joint or something. And her crafting's really high too, so she'll be able to make it really quickly. She's sleeping, letting that deer die. This deer should die soon. Oh, it's healing. Damn, it's healed. <laughs> this deer's dying though. Is it dead? Yeah, it's dead. Cancel this down. Oh wait, it's unconscious again. Yeah, it's fine though. The last joint. Okay, should be a good time to sow the crops. No, don't. Fine, fix the track. A little bit extra wood. Really need to sow these crops, girl. Now we don't have to refuel the fire for a hot minute. We should sow the crops next. After eating. And we should probably rest pretty soon. Repair the... Don't repair the wall. <laughs> there we go. Clearing the ground so you can plant, 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 plant the rice. You didn't have to kill that tree. There's no point. It was not in the way. Plant the plants. What's her plant skills at five? It's too terrible. No sleep, sleep time. Great. These guys are pretty interesting. They're more useful later. They're really tough uh, beasts. Let's see, does there tell their stats at all? Meat amount, leather amount. Wow, their their comfortable temperatures is from negative eighty to one twenty two. It's insane. Revenge chance on harm is 100%. Oh, they don't revenge on tame fail very much. 60% armor, that's so much. What's their, like, health? Did you see their health? Market leather, moose speed, trainability. Hmm. Doesn't give, like, a health number. But they're just like really fierce. But their their leather is like super tough. It's one of the best furs you can have. Makes really good clothing. Really strong. I think the best. Yeah, one of the best you can get. I think the best you can get from an animal. And then also, if you kill them, you get their horn, which is like a melee weapon, which is one of the better melee weapons. Maybe one of the best. Besides, probably like. A really good metal for like certain kind of swords and stuff. Yes, 
plant. Plant the plants. Yes, getting planted. Wow, already 28% from just that. Barely any time ago that she planted that. This hyper fertile soil is awesome. I never knew that was a thing. Rich soil. Is this rich soil? Never move these bodies. Are they? Is this human corpses? Yeah. She just hasn't gotten around to it. There we go. The smoke leaf crops. So she can use that for recreation. Maybe before you do this crafting, you should uh, haul these bodies away so you don't have to. Be repulsed by them. There's good old Bruno. Let's haul this guy. Got 40 more limestone. Can I make that much? I don't know. Oh, eventually I can. But her room is, her is dirty, so... It's still gonna be disgusting her. What I'll actually do... Let's put her clean on pretty high, but I'll... Make the home area smaller. Because they only clean the, the home area. Look at that, and then now her, I'll put her clean up to two, so she'll keep it clean. Very high priority. Hopefully it'll start making her happy. Oh, even these walls are negative two. If they're not polished. Clean, 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 clean. Beauty's almost at one, or zero, instead of negative. Okay, not this area. I wonder if she'll still do the crops if it's not in the home area. Probably. Wait, it says, comes to repair building, clean floors, and extinguish fires in the home area. Oh my god, you're going over here with the bodies. Oh, fucking hell. That's the only thing that's annoying is that whenever you make a zone or build, build something, it'll make a huge home area around it. It's so annoying. Flooring is looking nicer. Beauty is almost at zero. Got five limestone. Well, lots of limestone. And more to come. trees. What are you doing over there? Were you cleaning that? Okay, is it... Are these... The limestone tiles are creating home area. Fucking hell. Okay, beauty's almost at zero. She's working slower because it's dark in there. Why don't you refuel this? Come 
we'll actually do this until we have like 50. We could probably finish off the limestone here. And then while we're at it, we should just kind of kind of flesh this out. And then we could polish the walls. I do should get this steam too. Oh, beauty's almost at zero. Zero! Woohoo! It's not making her revolted. It still is an awful bedroom. She needs some, uh. You get like a dresser. Can I make a limestone dresser? Does that look better? She she carves these stone blocks so fast. It's probably worth it. I'm just gonna go for it. I can't prompt the building of it until I have some. That material. It's getting warmer outside, so I better refuel this. Consuming. Uh oh, I need food. Coming up. I should probably just harvest some of this rice. Or I can kill the rest of the does. There's a bear in the area. Or a turkey. Turkeys don't fight back. Kill the turkey. Refuel this. Get some berries. Where are you going? Is where the turkey is? Pew, 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 pew. Even if she misses, does she get more shooting? Yeah. So it's fine if she shoots forever. She's getting better at a uh, better shot. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she hit it yet? Yeah. There we go. Oh, it looks like I could save somebody. Beaver, chief of, has said, says her friend has been wounded while traveling. The victim is Valkyrie, a 61-year-old warrior. Beaver has nobody spared to rescue Valkyrie, but says that if you can make it to Valkyrie's position to rescue her, she will join you. Maybe an unknown threat. Oh, they're super... Oh, I thought that was close. Ooh, man, I wish I could go. But I need to have food. Probably per permichim. I wonder if I can survive just on berries walking there. I don't think so. Because they, when they travel, they automatically harvest ship the stars, just a ship to win the game, but obviously I, there's no way I could do that because you need to be able to defend it. I could just take all these simple meals. Let's see what it says as far as a caravan. Not even a, a day? Wow. That's actually pretty dope. I could probably... Oh, a rotten day. Oh. It might be worth to try to get this person. I might die. Fuck it, let's do it. like I have to take these risks. Aren't you forming a caravan?
What's this? Tortoise dead? Won't be, won't be ready by the time I get back. Oh, I hunted that too. Traveling along the road. Hopefully, passing these guys won't matter. Wish I had something to trade with these guys. Man, I go so fast along this road. Forging some berries. Hopefully, I don't get an encounter. I hope I have a bow on me. Okay. <laughs> I hope I can actually save this person too. They might have like turrets there. If I can add a person to my party, that'd be super sweet. Here we go. Generating map. It's paused, right? Oh, it's going. Wait. There's, I said there's an unknown threat. Is there a threat? There may be an unknown threat. Hell yeah, no threat. Fuck yeah. Well, it looks like we need to heal him. It's a medical bed. Oh, they're not. They just need a little bit of time to heal. For help. <gasps> what the hell was that? That was bullshit. He came, he literally came out of nowhere. He's a knife. I might die. And he could have been in range. Let's see if I can, I can like run and shoot him. Shit, this is bad news. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, one more time. Run, 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 run. Okay, I gotta fight him. Well, this might be it. He's a knife and I have a bow. We're in a melee fight. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hit him. I'm bleeding. Well, it was good. <laughs> now, the question is, will it let me load? Oh, I had to quit. Caravan was lost. Everyone is... Okay, will it let me load after that? I think so. That was such bullshit. Okay, I'm still doing the caravan. Oh my gosh. Should I still do fight? That ambush was so dumb. Eh, yeah, let's try again. Wild woman wanders in? Okay. Fuck that. I want that. Oh, wait, where's my plate? Okay. Fuck this ambush with a guy with a knife while I have a bow. Such bullshit. I guess I should have just brought a knife. But now a wild woman I can tame. Oh wait, I bet I need a certain taming skill. It would at least let me load again. Where are all these dead animals coming from? Who's killing these animals? Oh, maybe the bear. I guess I could see what hit it. Yeah, grizzly bear. A bunch of his limbs are torn off. Leg. Three of its leg and its neck. <laughs> oh, and this raccoon. The lynx. And the lynx died. And what killed the lynx? The raccoon killed the lynx. They killed each other. That's free meat. Where's the wild woman? Sarai. Ooh. 
Are you walking out now? Okay, it looks like I tamed them. I hope not, okay. She's resting. Sweet, I could probably get this person. Oh wait, they're bleeding. No. Ten intellectual, ten crafting. Ooh, animals are a super, and all these super fire, super passionate. Um, is she gonna eat my food? Aw, oh, come on! <laughs> Eating my food. Now I have no food left. To the ones I have with me. Okay, I still have four meals. Okay, well, we'll have to see what happens with this wild woman next time on Rimworld Naked Edition. Da 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 da.